I think it meant a lot because uh, you know we alluded to uh, having 22 to 24 freshmen sophomores very short time window to prepare a lot of unknowns and we were all very curious to see what uh, the first 90 minutes against a uh, nationally ranked team how what it would look like and I thought uh, overall we were pretty pleased with some of the things we saw on, uh, on Friday. Actually Cal State Bakersfield is more dangerous they uh, they are a very good team. They got some great athletes. Um, they got incredible speed up top. They beat Riverside 5 0. I think the danger with a Bakersfield is that they, the name in itself doesn't inspire any fear, you know, in, in our players. But I only need to remind them that we lost 2 0 at home against Bakersfield. And they are better this year than they were last year. So, you know, we're definitely going to be up for that. We need to be ready up for that game. And on Sunday, We'll be going to Sac State, which I think is going to be around 100 degree weather in Sacramento. And Sacramento has been an NC2A playoff team the last two years, including a first round victory over LMU. So uh, we got two really strong opponents coming up this week. Our goal as a team was to, uh, to show the students and the fans and the alumni, you know, that uh, this is the start of a very, you know, bright future of USF soccer. And that the, the fans and the students would see a young, energetic team that will play with passion and heart for this program. And I think uh, that the students saw a glimpse of that. And I think, uh, you know, it should be one of the main factors for the students to come back because I know that this young team will come out and play its hardest, as hard as they can every game in, game out.